Hello and welcome back to Diablo 3 of uh, um, starting Act 3. <laughs> yep, that, that's... Yep, I don't really know what else to say, I just got off work. It was kind of the same as yesterday. Not, not, not that good. It was not fun. <laughs> But yeah, we will be starting. Hey, Mister, I got some new things. You should take a look. Yeah, we just last stream we beat the Lord of Lies, Belial, and we are now heading. Oh, I don't remember the name of the fort, but I do know that it's near Mount Ariad because that is where Asmodan is. Asmodan. So yeah, let's start. I can be ready to leave at a moment's notice. Let me know when you are prepared to go. Asmodan's voice sounds different. Chaldeum is free of Belial and his lies. Yet Asmodan remains. With his armies staged in Ariat Crater, 
the ancient bulwark of Bastion's keep is all that keeps him in check. I will not let that mighty fortress fall. Bastion's Keep, that's what it was called. That is also like my favorite uh, cutscene in this entire game. Really cool. Also, like I said before, Asmodean's voice sounds different. I remember it being a lot more deeper and more guttural. I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> the Keep's defenses cannot hold. Its soldiers are scattered fleeing before Asmodan's onslaught, which rushes forth from Ariat Crater. Should the keep fall, Asmodan will claim the Black Soul Stone. If he does, there will be no hope for this world. It will stand. I must rally the defenders. Light the signal fires, and show these soldiers that we have not yet defeated. Salvation has arrived. Go, you are needed below. Tyrion will not fail these people, I know- The Black Soul Stone's getting hotter, straining against me. They're whispering to me from inside. The demons within seek escape. Only your power can keep it from splitting apart, my daughter. It's a heavy burden, but the fate of the world lies in your hands. Someone's got to light those signal fires. You heard the angel's command. Let the call sound forth. Bastion's keep shall not fall. Clear the walls. Tear them down. Demon troopers form the meat of the armies of hell. Their masters use them roughly, sending them into the vanguard for most battles. For their part, the troopers are easily excited by opportunities to exhibit their great talent for violence. In fact, the troopers frequently attack each other when they are left idle. We saw the signal fire. We must light the rest, but the demons swarm around them. Get back inside the keep! No, I have to help hold the walls. This is monstrous. He was little more than a boy. Asmodan created the demonic Hell Flyers after he nearly lost to Tyrael in battle thousands of years ago. The angels made glorious use of their great luminescent wings to outmaneuver the demon host and assail its commander. Frustrated by his near defeat, Asmodan began breeding winged demons capable of tearing the angels I require more asunder. Wrath. I had long hoped that the demonic hellbearer was a fiction, a nightmare from the troubled minds of my ancestors. Just imagine, 
A demon taller than a castle tower who can retch up endless minions from the depths of- You're a welcome sight, hero! What is that purple? What the freak is that? Oh, it's gone. Wormhole? Oh. Oh, what the fuck? That's new? Not enough round. It's an honor to fight by your side. Apparat favors me. enough wrath. Transferring to Bastion's keep is as dull as I imagined. The soldiers spend most of their time gambling. I guess this is what I should expect from this hollowed out rock, a shadow of its former glory. Still, I am here to provide for Anna. I hope she's well. Good thought. Excellent. Bastards didn't stand a chance. No 
are well deserved. We're all going to die. Fight with everything you've got. Not yet. Ah, finally, a challenge. The colossal Tolgor is merely a colossal myth. In folklore, they are sons of an infamous demon who smashed half of hell in anger after the prime evils were defeated during the Dark Exile. Why, if I had a gold coin for each of these tales, I would be a wealthy man indeed. Hero. So you're the wretch that's given me such trouble. Thrash as you might, you will not keep me from the soul stone. What in the hells was that? Uh, an idle threat. We've seen the fires you've lit. Fear has no more hold on us. The catapults could break Asmodan's lines, but we can't raise them from their berths while demons swarm over the walls. Have your men reinforce the battlements. I'll make sure the catapults are raised. It is grim out here, but we've seen worse. Run! Opponents may be strong, but I will not stand down. Thank the heavens you're here. We're down to four lads until reinforcements arrive. Trouble is, the lift stopped. We can't see what went wrong through all the muck down there. Oh, what now? More of the brutes from below, Captain. What do we do? Private, if you need to be told which end of the sword goes where, you haven't been paying attention. Fight to your last breath, lads! The lift is moving again. Hold steady, lads. Reinforcements are on their way. Demons. Get ready, men. Oh, crap. Victory! More blessed shield damage. The 
tormented stingers may resemble giant scorpions, but in truth, they are molded from the bodies of human sacrifices. The demons twist their victims into the stingers' distinctive forms by slicing open their chests and viciously mutilating their legs. Maddened by pain, these creatures can poison their prey with a single strike. Enough. I don't remember the scorpions. I can't die like this. Save yourself. He did. The captain looked grim today. A messenger came in the middle of the night. They know something they aren't telling us. Maybe coming here was a big mistake, they thought. here. I am in a bad spot. The crusade marches on. Holy crap. Okay. I did put this on hard mode, <laughs> so, uh, is this to be expected? You must be the one that lit the signal fires. Help me free the recruit so they can raise this catapult. Over here! Okay. Oh, I have to go over here. Excellent. Let's protect the recruits while they raise the catapult.
They're coming back. Ready yourselves. Report that more of those wretched demon hell bearers will be here any moment. The soldiers need to be protected. The platform will rise more quickly if we don't lose men. Oh my god, that's a lot of gold. I require more rack. Said the thing. <laughs> Bad luck for you, friend. Not ready yet. Lieutenant, are you alone? Of course I'm bloody well alone. Everyone else has gone and died. But I'll be damned if I'll leave my post. Make yourself useful and spin that winch. Kurtipal, I am not strong enough to lift you alone. Could you please ask my friend over there to lend a bloody hand? Captain Ho, I'd watch my temper. Do me a favor, and don't mention that I shouted at you a little, right? I'm returning to town.
Asmodan's demons have opened an enormous hole in our walls and are flooding into the depths. If it is not closed, the keep will be overrun. Then I will seal it. I bring word from the King of Westmarch. Has he agreed to send us reinforcements? My lord says he will send no living men to battle imaginary demon lords. Perhaps he'll believe when his kingdom is burnt to ashes around him. The demons are in the keep! They're coming up from the depths! To arms! To arms! I would ask if you're all right. I know that. That was hardly an ambush, anyway. Do you remember when the barbarians tried the same thing 30 years ago? <laughs> they tried to steal you away, didn't they? Rippers are the bane of the living, creatures born of the endless malice churning within hell. Agile and swift, the rippers cover ground quickly by latching onto prey with their enormous tongues and then leaping on top of their victims. From this point, the ripper cannot be deterred. It has begun to feast. I have been fortunate enough to learn much of the Barbarians' complicated history in my time, yet the origins of these large, mighty warriors are hazy at best. Legend holds that they are the offspring of Volkathos, an ancient who embodied their ideals of strength, bravery, and courage. enough rap.
These creatures won't go down easily. I hear sly giggling from the walls all around. The demons think to ambush us. They can think twice. Power before Zakarum. of hell. We will see them drown in our tide of sin. The girl is still weak, and their hero will not expect us to attack from below. Send in the ravening beast. Missing something. Yes, I am. I see it now. Like chaff before the wind. The children of Bull Kathos settled in the northern steppes, an area that is now known as the Dreadlands. Theirs was primarily a nomadic and tribal culture, though they had a few permanent settlements such as Cesaron and Haragoth, a group of revered former warriors known as the Elder Council ruled the barbarians.
Good choice. Oh my god, what is that? Blue? Like the adversary is before us. I I have no idea what that blue thing did. For Zakarum. Holy moly. This will help. Evil is closing in around this keep. We must protect the innocent. One usually hears demonic tremors before seeing them. These behemoths move slowly and heavily, pounding the earth with their massive fists. Many a siege has been broken by the tremors' battering strikes, and many more enemies of the demons have been felled by their wrath. I pray that our world will never see them again.
Not yet. They should have run when they had the chance. We cannot fail these people. Our opponents may be strong, but I will not stand down. Light be damned. Enjoyed that. I require more wrath. friend. Not enough wrath. The barbarians have always defended their lands in the north from trespassers. They believe that it is their sacred charge to guard Mount Ariat and the world stone within it from the outside world. 
Unfortunately, their battle prowess and tenacity have been misinterpreted as bloodthirst and territorial savagery by soldiers in Westmarch. already inside your walls, and his hunger is ravenous. He will devour your corpse, and those of your friends. No, get the fuck back here, you fucking goblin. Just the thing. wanted to fight some of these. My wrath is low. Patience. Come on with the stupid running away thing. Okay, cool. They say that Asmodan is the greatest battle commander in all the burning hells. Well, doesn't say much for the hells then, does it? <laughs> yeah, I should have enough room. We are not alone in here.
the one who killed Lord Belial. I will save her, tearing the flesh from your bones. of Asmodan's sin lieutenants, and he possesses no less than four mouths. Though his voracious appetite is certainly his greatest weapon, his bile, and, well, other noxious excretions are equally lethal. When last seen in battle, the Lord of Gluttony swallowed half a dozen angels whole, spears and all. This will aid me. I'm returning to town. <sighs> the human prisoners are panicking now. Oh, they must have noticed that fresh meat only comes after one of their number is dragged away, screaming. This will not hold. Slaughter the ones who starve themselves and feed them to their hungry friends. When those ones are fully starved, I will be ready to die. I need to go back. A useless tool. You have only delayed your inevitable destruction. Your laws have grown no stronger. Our assault continues unabated. The stone will still be mine. Terrifying noises were coming from the armory, so Tyriel went to investigate. He said if you were to return, I should send you there. The Soul Stone seems stable now. The demon's rage has been subdued. Yes, but for how long? Our time grows short. We must take this fight to Asmodan. Then we shouldn't waste time discussing it. 
I will break their battle lines, enter the crater, and end this. Can you feel the keep shuddering? Asmodan's siege weapons. Saving these walls will have meant nothing if they're reduced to rubble. I'll shatter those weapons before that happens. At last! I thought I was going to die when I saw the demon's rage escape from the soul stone. Tyrion and my friend fought them, but I couldn't help. It was like I was watching them through a haze. What is the soul stone doing to me? Asmodan must die soon, and I will be myself again. Okay, I feel like that sh this is a good place to stop for tonight. I will continue this sometime later. Not entirely sure when. Because I have- I want to play more Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. But um, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all in the next stream. Goodbye!